Isla today. Not the best, but we did what we could. I was having so I was struggling with this palette this morning. By golly, but I was making it work. <laughs> the look did come out as pretty as can be. Don't ask what's happening on the sides of my face. Who knows? <laughs> so we ended up using this shade. I started off with this shade all right here. It doesn't have a name. They're all numbered. So start off with this shade in our crease. Then I went in with this the shade right above it, which looks like 2 to 3 shades lighter. It is not. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I was like, crud. I don't want it all mushed together. So then I went in with the shade at the top. So it kind of made it look, I don't know, kind of made it all go together. So on the inside of our crease right here, we have this shade. But it was a little too dark for me, so I went in with this one. We're, we're on our top. This makes a nice little topper, though, so I'm not mad. And for the outside of the crease, I have this pretty blue. And for the inner corner, I have this one. It is in the saddle from ColourPop. I'm not for sure what collection this came from, though. It's their ultra glitter. Yeah. Yeah, so, oh, lips. Lips was uh, milk makeup in the shade low key today. Just a neutral, neutral look to go with a pretty neutral look. Also, don't let people tell you you need to practice your makeup more. If you like how you like it, you're okay. You do, at the end of the day, we are doing makeup to please ourselves. We want to share it with the world and be like, look, I am so proud of my creation. Girl, you do it. Don't let them dim your light, because you know what? This is a canvas, a blank canvas every morning, and we paint it how we want, because what is it? Makeup has no rules on this page. None. No, no rules here. We do what we like, because we like it. Just a PSA. So if you get those people who comment about like, you should do this and you should do that, pay no need to them. Curse girl, bye bye, Felicia. That's it. All right, let's go to Tuesday's look. Oh, it's just starting the video itching my ear. <laughs> so let's show you all what's on the papers. I actually added a palette to this week because um. <sighs> The Wet n Wild palette, it's not, it kind of fools you. It's not as bright as some of the colors are, so I'm like, oh, I gotta have some brights. So lesson learned for next week, you know? So I end up pulling in the Pinky Rose Obsessed palette. I actually have never used this, so now it's been used. <laughs> so I have the Whatever shade in our crease, and then the Party On yellow right above it which is which is kind of funny because whenever me and my co-worker depart we say party on <laughs> so yeah that's that and then on the inner corner we have the shade dang gina can i don't think i could say the other word on the inter interweb without being whatever flagged or whatever but this is right here and then I'm going to do the TARDIS Pro Remix palette. I love this palette. And we went into the shade. Which one did I go into? Oh, color explosion. We went into this green shade, which I'm starting to get a dip at the top of it. I don't know why, but went to the color explosion shade. So that's that. So that's our eye look. On the inner corner, though, I did use... In the saddle. Right? Hold on. Let me relook. Sometimes I remember and sometimes I do not. No. I used two colors from the TARDIS Pro. I used the shade Sway. So this is what's on our inner corner. Okay. Well, yeah. Those are our eyes. Lips today. 
it's kind of all the way off now, but as you can see, we have a little friend. <laughs> so it's going to be CarMax and Lansing with repair stuff. It's the ColourPop Lippy in the shade Hopti. Oh, I said it correct this time. Mm -hmm. Let me know if you guys get the Care Bear collections in hand because I'm going to be jealous. I'm going to have to order from the site. I really want it. Because by the time I make it to my Walmart, my Walmart will either not get it or they'll get it and be sold out. From everybody who's going to resell it for three times the price on the card. You know? <laughs> Alright, so this is our Tuesday look. Dun, dun, dun. Let's go to Wednesday. Alright, so this is our today's look. It is Wednesday. Very pretty. See what's on the eyeballs. No lips today. So I got a healing code sore. Oh yeah, can't see it now, but it was way worse. That looks better. Still there though, so don't want to take my lip products. So we have on the Wet n Wild Wild Hearts palette. You know, you ever struggle so hard with a palette that you kind of like it, but kind of don't like it? This is me right now. This palette, so like, listen, you see this in Walmart for 20 bucks. It's not a beginner friendly palette, okay? Not beginner friendly. That's what I have to say. Or at least it's not me friendly. It's a bit of both. So I have on the lid, we have, we have this little shade right here. They're numbered. So we have this one on our crease. And I went through, I put, because I put this one down first all over my lid area. Then I went through with the black shade, which you see. And to, to try to make it a little less harsh, I went in with, with this shade. With, I went in with this shade from the top. So that's where I went in with over to the top to make it a little less harsh. And then, out of this palette. We went into a Tartus Pro Remix. If you hear a bunch of running, it's my cats. They have the zoomies. It's almost two o'clock in the morning when I'm filming this, so. So on our creases, both creased shades are from this Tartus Pro palette. Uh, so for the inner crease is the shade Art, Art Deco. I have this on the inner side of that. And then on the outside is the graffiti, graffiti shade. So that's on the outside. That's what we use in this palette. Also, I really like, this is my favorite Tarte palette besides my mermaid palette. And it smells good too. And so the inner corner that you see is a ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in the shade Moon Daisy. So this is what's here. Did you guys see that they're doing a peep? release collab hmm. i'm i'm highly interested i might pick it up it's not my i probably will <laughs> all of them it's not the lip products i don't think we'll see all right so this is wednesday's look so let's go on to thursday's look all right so this is today's eye look Someone told me on my Instagram I looked, or not on Instagram, on one of the Facebook groups I was like an outer space mermaid, and I'm like, oh, yes, thank you. Okay, so let's show you what I got, and then I have a small haul to include with part of this clip. I'm going to start including, like, small hauls and random tidbits in our weekly, since I'm only posting a couple times a week, I'm basically I'm just posting on the weekend. I tried posting during the week with my hours, and uploaded only half my video and didn't have the other half of the video saved so I'm like there's no going back from that that's sleep work brain <laughs> okay so we have I started out I used two palettes and two single shadows today so I started off using the pinky rose obsessed palette and I went into the shade cookie which is this right here I think that's the only shade I used from this yeah I basically went into this palette for the shade cookie and then went into our Profusion palette, Peaceful Peony, for the shade 
lash, which I have it right above this. And on the inner part of our crease is the shade Glorious, which is this right here. It's like a topper shade, but if you pack it on enough, it makes a nice little shimmer. And so then we went into ColourPop. It is the shade Coconut, which is on the outer edge right here. Coconut. Mine's starting to dry out. I need to buy a new one. And then I used Cami Crush, also from ColourPop, and have it on the inner corner on the eyes. So, yeah. No lipstick yet. Still got a cold sword there. It's almost gone, though, so it's working its way out of the system. That's nice. Um, so, yeah, I have a small haul. I didn't, I didn't make two purchases for, um... Sephora for their 20% off sale because I'm probably not going to be rogue next year, which is fine because I've got way back on my spending for makeup. So, yeah, because we're trying to use what's in our stash. But I did get, I did pick up the Natasha Denona pastel palette. So, we'll be seeing looks with this soon. Oh, and I also dropped this too. I was like, look how pretty, and then dropped it. <laughs> my soul left my body. But, yeah. Here she is. Super excited for that. And the other part of that haul was I picked up the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion in the shade Eden. So it's supposed to dry down matte, so I got this to try. Yeah. I do have an empties video you guys will see before this. So I figured I'd try this because it dries down with some color to the base. Yeah, I like that. And then I have a repurchase. I went on Macari. I'm a big Macari shopper. I love them. And got the more 39S Such a Gem Palette. Because when I first started my channel, I thought, oh, I gotta do the clutters. I gotta get rid of things. I can't have too many of the same colored color palettes. And two years down the line, I realized that's a lie. I have as many purple palettes as I want. So I missed it and rebought it. It's not so pretty. I love it. So yeah, that's our eye look and a little bit of what came in the mail today. So let's go to Friday's look. All right, so this is Friday's look. We're just bare nude here, just chilling. Um, so what I will show you is what I got in the mail today and then what I, what thing get uploaded in the rest of the haul. So I think that, I believe that was just a couple of the palettes. And I believe a foundation, I think. I think that was it. I think I was just missing our perfusion palettes. I think this was in that haul. I was not for sure, but this was part of the part of the stuff I got. I don't believe I picked up anything else. Gotta rack my brain. Who knows? I, I, if I didn't show this, this was in part of the haul that didn't get uploaded. There was the Chilling Wonder Palette Powder from Hard Candy. And then there was that foundation, that Clean Cover Girl foundation. I know I showed the Blooming, I showed the Blooming collection. So yeah, so this is the other half of the haul. It is two, four, six Pro Fusion Mini Palettes. So let's go ahead. It's the Peaceful Peony, which you seen me pick out last week from the Shop My Stash. So we have this. And you would see that you in one look this week. So I actually did like this. So there's the Peaceful Peony from Profusion. And we have Terrific Tulip. This is a Terrific Tulip palette. And then we have Pretty Poppy. Uh, the Romantic Rose. The packaging's super cute too. It has the flowers on it. So here's the Romantic Rose. I can't, look at that shimmer. That's gonna be so pretty on the eye. And then there is the 
honest hibiscus. And then the last one of the six is a delightful dahlia. Or dahlia? I might have nicked it with my finger when I first moved it. But this is so pretty. That glitter looks really nice too. But yeah, those are the palettes that you missed that I showed. Uh, my dumb dumb self. Uh, working, working overtime. Uh, overtime sleep brain forgot to fully edit my video and only <laughs> edit, put up half of it so that was the other half of that um, and what I got into mail today was the Jeffree Star Beauty Killer 2 palette so let's show the inside of that look how cute so pretty and this is like more cohesive I think than his original Beauty Killer palette uh, like this dark you can go with this that can go with that that can go there this will work with here work with that work with that you know so many so many things to do the only man thing for me is there's like what it looks like there's only so you got three true shimmers and then one sparkle mat that sparkle mat I don't know why brands put the sparkles in there, but that's just going to rub out, basically. Unless you just pat, 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 pat. But yeah, so you got three true shimmers. One, two, three, four, five, six mattes. And one shimmer mat. That's not bad. Yeah, so tell me, what look was your favorite look? What was your favorite items I received in the mail? Because, uh, the... Because basically, my brain, it's easier for me to upload on Saturdays and Sundays. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's just easier. I work too much. But yeah, let me know. What do you think? Do you like the in the added interjections for the Monday through Friday? Do you like that? Do you not? It's just basically, it'd be a bigger upload video because it'd be a pop. I don't know. Depending on what I do, what I talk about, let me know. Really interested. I do want to try to start recording some eye looks. I want to try, but get home from work I just out like a light you know let me know all right uh thanks for watching hope to see you in the next one bye